Okay, here we go with another bad driving video. Let's see what we Welcome got. Welcome back, guys. Hope you'll enjoy today's video, too. Stay safe. Ooh, excuse me. I'm almost on that board already. Charlotte, North Carolina. Do -do -do -do. Do -do -do -do. Good lord. People need to learn how to cut their videos down. Get right to the meat of it. What the hell? And you're just gonna sit there and let him do whatever the hell he's doing? <laughs> What is he doing? He's old as fuck. Saw this incident on a trip back home. Didn't notice the black Civic on left. Full of teen when one threw a water bottle to the white car at first. They started acting weird, slowing down and swerving until the next light, where the guy got out and started hitting the black car and smearing a liquid on it and then damaged their side mirror. Offered the Civic footage, but they declined. What the heck, dude? Ohio! No, okay, you had time to slow down. Seriously? Seriously, but you also had time to slow down. Lizzie, I know. What the heck was that? <laughs> Made a U turn <laughs> cut over to my lane. Over the median, too, dummy. It's a great way to ruin your car. What's up? Hi, 18 wheeler. I look like another 18 wheeler. Green Bay! Oh, hey. Bad drivers in Green Bay just don't stop. It's pretty much anywhere. Remember, given the wide angled lens, vehicles are closer than they appear. Alright. Washington! buddy. A white explorer crosses the center line and nearly takes out me and the car in front of me. After the video ended, I turned around to call him in. A little ways down the road, he took a turn too fast and crashed into a swamp. Sadly, I didn't catch that. Footage was submitted to the MVPD. So we don't see him turning around. San Diego, what the heck? Okay, San Diego. What the? People in a charger being very stupid. Clearly. Oh, more San Diego. Whoa! Hi! Dude. Jeep just has to turn from middle lane. San Diego again. It's a lot of San Diego. Hi. Oh, dude. Back on your side of the road, buddy. Especially on a hill. Oh my goodness. Is this all from one guy? One, two, three. Yep, saw that coming. San Diego again. Whoa! Did you just spin out in a wet road? What happened? Slow down in the rain. My brother took a turn in the rain too fast. He's lucky he didn't hit anybody. Oh, it's a lot of San Diego today. Yeah, I know. <gasps> what are you doing? Gay and Lex... G gay. Sorry. Guy and Lexus. I can read. Had his mirrors folded in for some reason. They're kind of important, I would say. And hopefully he has a rear view mirror. 
Because even with outside mirrors, you should have a rear view mirror. Freaking use it, dude. Okay, now we're in Cal Sacramento, California. Dude! <clears throat> I'm just gonna keep vlogging. Homeless guy was running a red light. <laughs> I don't think he was running. Going out into the stream of cars, he caused an accident. The police found this boom. <laughs> Wiggins. Whoa! Okay, dude. You just go about your merry way there. All I have to say is it didn't end worse than that. I'm grateful for my dash cam. I had my blinker on. I was going to turn right into my driveway. But my parents were coming out at the same time, so I stopped to let them out, and that's when this dude almost rear-ended me. Good lord. Freaking hurry, people. Can't wait five seconds. You don't save that much time, honestly. In fact, you might even lose time if you're getting in an accident or get pulled over by the police. Whoa! <laughs> oh. As typical, the car coming toward us blows the stop sign. But this time, he's met by a local cop. Both cars were on the brakes, so the collision doesn't look too bad. But the hit turns the cop siren on, which he then dismisses. About a minute later, he activates the lights and turns his car around to impede traffic. About 18 minutes later, Tiltuk shows up and hauls the red car away, unsure of injuries at this time. So I guess the police were chasing this car? Good lord. Guy drives right to a stop sign at 2.20 a.m. It doesn't look like he hit the brakes at all. Unlucky guy with the right of way T-boned him immediately. Not loud noises commence shortly thereafter. Good grief. Yet another accident on my street. No injury. Stop signs are known to be difficult to maneuver. Right? So stop signs are just a suggestion, apparently. Hello! Fantastic driving by a black SUV, baby Audi, narrowly misses a construction truck. Would have been a bad accident otherwise. The white truck has a stop sign. It looks like a food truck. Oh, no, it's a construction truck. The way it was paused, I paused it, it was like that. Look, that was part of the truck. I was thinking it was like a roof of the food truck, but it's, it's a construction truck. Hey, bro! Hit. Neither of us were injured. The young man immediately admitted complete fault and seemed mostly worried about his insurance premiums increasing and tried to talk him out of calling police or involving insurance company, saying the damage didn't look that bad. Naturally, I politely declined his request. My truck is literally brand new and still has that new car smell with only 13k on the odometer. KM. Damage has been determined in excess of $41,000. I'm still I'm assuming that's Canadian. I'm still waiting to hear from my insurance company, but I fully expect the vehicle will be written off. Man, brand new vehicle gets totaled. For some dumb kid. You piece of shit. That'd be my response. Dublin, Ohio. <laughs> oh, jeez Louise. Successfully okay. disabled Ugh, the rail road crossing so that it was I'm sure where we are here. Jeez <laughs> Louise. Saving time will cost you and others. I've been saying that. This is Manitoba. Uh, Manitoba already ruled the white car to be at fault 100%, both because I had the right of way, I was on the main road, and they had a stop sign. Also, due to unsafe crossing as they came out between cars blind. More or less. Technically, insurance never saw the video as I had a witness stop and provide me with their info to pass on to MPI. So they never requested the video.
in fast food before i've worked drive through i always found that those shifts they always went by quicker when you were busy yeah, yeah right oh, yeah. instead of just sitting there texting las vegas dude oh crap we're ended while yielding to the person walking other driver okay i think i've seen this one other driver given 100% liability. My lovely Prius got rear-ended a while ago from someone young who didn't notice I was stopped. I got the seek on. Psych on. You can see on my page now. Wanted another Prius, but in 2022, car prices are higher. So my payout wasn't enough for another similar mile one. Good grief. That camera went tumbling, didn't it? Illinois, all Florida. Whoa! What the heck? Drive home from work, caught this on the side of the road. No one was badly injured. Holy crap. Slow down in the rain, people. Of course, Texas. Part of Texas, dude. Texas is huge. Whoa! Holy crap. <coughs> Holy crap. Lady on the right decides to blow a stop sign and cause a wreck. I stopped and helped the dude that was in front of me out of his car. I had to force the door open and pop the airbag with my pocket knife. He seemed okay, just shaken up. As for the girl who caused the wreck, she seemed to have some kind of back injury. Prayers for everybody's speed of recovery. Again... Running a stop sign, does that save you any freaking time if you hit somebody? You're not going to get where you're going. You don't, a few seconds can turn into a few hours or days or forever if you get killed or kill somebody. Look, 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 look. Again. Gray Escalade almost rear ends someone behind us, causing them to drive on the right shoulder. They continue to drive on the right shoulder and almost cause an accident with someone entering the highway. Well, that's a lane now. Oh, so sorry about the yawning. Alright, people. You know, just stay safe. Stay safe. <laughs>